ListMonk is a self-hosted powerhouse for newsletters and mailing lists. Experience seamless email campaigns with a built-in feature to auto-push PostgreSQL backups to S3 daily. Let's see how we can simply self-hosted ListMonk on AWS. Go to Matrix ListMonk in AWS Marketplace and click the Continue to Subscribe button. After subscribing, you will need to accept the terms and conditions. Click on Accept Terms to proceed. Please wait for a few minutes while the processing takes place. Once it's completed, click on Continue to Configuration. Select your preferred region in Configure this software page and click Continue to Launch button. From the Choose Action drop-down menu in Launch this software page, select Launch Cloud Formation and click Launch button. Ensure the template is ready. Radio button is selected under Prepare Template. Click Next. Provide a unique stack name. Provide the admin email for SSL generation. For deployment name, enter a name of your choice. Provide a public domain name for domain name. ListMonk will automatically try to set up SSL based on provided domain name if that domain hosted on Route 53. Choose an instance type, instance type recommended, T3, medium. Select your preferred key name name of an existing EC2 key pair for sh access to the EC2 instance. Enter a strong password for ListMonk password password for ListMonk web interface. Enter a strong password for PostgreSQL password password for PostgreSQL database. Provide a S3 bucket name to S3 bucket for storing PostgreSQL backups. Set sh location as 0000. Keep subnetsidro block as 10 24 Keep Vipsitter lock as 10 16 Click Next. Now we can configure stack options. Under Stack Failure Options, select Roll Back All Stack Resources. Click Next. Now review and verify the details you've entered. Tick the box that says, I acknowledge that AWS CloudFormation might create EM resources with custom names. Click Submit. Afterward, you'll be directed to the CloudFormation Stacks page. You can easily locate the corresponding stack by searching for the stack name you entered in Step 2. Please wait for 5 to 10 minutes until the stack has been successfully created. Afterward, you can click the Refresh button under the stack section. After creation is completed, we can update DNS. Copy the public IP labeled Public IP in the Outputs tab. Go to AWS Route 53 and navigate to Hosted Zones. From Hosted Zones, select the domain you provided to domain name. Click Edit Record in the Record Details and then paste the copied public IP into the value text box. Click Save. Now you can access the ListMonk application through the dashboard URL provided in the Outputs tab. Click Login button and enter ListMonk as the username. For the password, use the ListMonk password that you entered in the Step 2, Specify Stack Options under the Create CloudFormation Stack section. Then click Sign in to proceed. You will navigate to the ListMonk dashboard. Before you start, please go to the General tab in the Settings and modify the root URL to correspond with your domain. Additionally, adjust the default from email according to your preference, then click on Save. Now navigate to your Google account. In the Security section, enable two-step verification. Use the search bar to find the App Passwords option and navigate to the App Passwords section. Provide an app name and click on Create to generate. Once generated, copy the password and ensure to keep it safe as it will not be visible again. Now we can test SMTP. Navigate to the SMTP tab in the ListMonk settings. Provide the following details. Host, smountp.gmail.com Port, 465 Auth protocol, login Username, your Gmail address Password, previously generated password. To email, an email address to which you want to send test email.
Put a default from email and click on send email. If everything is in order, you will receive a test email. Save the settings and you're all set to proceed.